Howdy, everybody. This is Chad. We got us a new toy for the business. We have got a... I think it's a Prototech. It's a Prototech RD223 kilohertz locator. And what you do with this is it's got a flushable transmitter that you flush and a thing that tells you where the lids are. Keeps us from guessing. This works as long as there ain't no roots or no backups or anything in your system. Alright. Well, here it is. There it is. First time I've seen it. I've used one before. Another guy, I know he's got one. I've used it a couple times. <clears throat> That's the name of it. Now let's see what it looks like. Figure out how to get it open. There we go. Kind of hard to get open. We'll have to grease it a little. That's what it looks like. There's that. There's some keys if you want to lock it up. There's that. And here it is. I think that's for your headphones if you wanted them, but I really didn't need the headphones, so. Yeah, that's it. Cut it on, cut it off, near and far button on it. Guess it comes with the batteries. Not sure what kind of batteries. Oh, yeah. Oh, wow. It's got one, two, three, four, five, six double A batteries. <coughs> it comes with them, apparently. Then you get these. And you flush these down the toilet. You can either flush it or you can put it down a clean out. And uh, it beeps and this locates it. So we might do a little video here in a little bit about finding it if we can figure it out. But a lot of people, they'll tie a fishing line to this. And you can put it on a little fishing pole and flush it down the toilet and you can reel it back up. But I've heard that it'll cut the fishing line if you run it through a toilet so if i ever do that i might do it through a clean out or something but that's it i've not seen many videos on youtube about one of these but it's a neat little thing this is you just go out there in the yard and swap it back and forth but this is the unboxing of it and there's what it looks like we just got it today so first time for me seeing it and you seeing it too but yeah, it's pretty neat. You might go out there and hide. I'll get one of the kids to go out there and hide us a transmitter. We'll cut one of these on. And these floats. So whenever you do send one down the toilet, it'll float in the septic tank. And whenever it falls out your line, it'll land where it lands at is right up from it is used is where your lid's at. So this really helps in saving a lot of time whenever you can't find one with a probe. Because normally I try to use a probe on finding them, but we're growing our business, so this is part of growing. You gotta spend a little money to make a little money, so but this is it. And for tax purposes. <laughs> But this is a nice case. I started not to get the case, but I figured throwing it around in my truck, it'll help be helpful. So. <clears throat> but, but that's it. Well, let's, we'll stop this video and uh, we'll go get ready and we'll, we'll start, uh, we'll go hide us one of the signs, they call them. We'll go hide it and see if we can't go locate it. 
So we'll talk to you in a little bit. We'll make another one. So this is part one. Get ready for part two. We'll see y'all a little bit. Bye.